barely 12 hours after earning Singapore's first Asian Games Athletics medal in 49 years. Shanti Pereira was back on the track at the Hangzhou Olympic Sports Center Stadium on Sunday, October 1st. After winning a silver medal in the Blue Ribbon Women's 100m final on Saturday evening, the sprinter had little time to reflect on her momentous achievement and was instead preparing for her second impact event. The Women's 200m Eventually, the 27-year-old advanced comfortably into Monday evening's final, clocking 23.14 seconds to qualify as the fastest among the 24 women field. Borin's Edidion Odion was second fastest at 23.35 seconds, while China's Huang Guifeng's 23.54 seconds effort was the fastest. Pereira is bidding to become the first Singaporean track and field gold medalist since 1974, when Chi Sui Li swept to victory in the women's 400 meter in Iran's capital of Tehran. If she manages to win, she will also become only the third Singaporean to clinch an athletics gold after Chi and in Yang Chang in the men's 110 meter hurdles way back in 1951. She has been in stellar form all year. Breaking the women's 200m national record four times and the 100m mark six times, as she won the 100m and 200m races at both the SEA Games and Asian Athletics Championships. Another Singaporean sprinter, Elizabeth Ann Tan, finished fourth in her 200m heat in 24.84 seconds and did not advance into the final. Meanwhile, hurdler Ong Chen Xiong, who won gold in dramatic fashion at the Cambodia SEA Games in May, qualified for the men's 110m final with a time of 13. 90 seconds, enough for the seven best time in the morning heats. His final is also set for Monday evening, with Kuwait's Yuko Aluha being the fastest qualifier with a 13.69 seconds effort.